Um, so the kind of diagnosis we see with our kids um, it can be the same as residential, just the acuity is not maybe as high. Uh, we take kiddos that have suicidal ideation, struggling with eating disorders, substance use. A lot of the kids that we're seeing right now are starting to come in with OCD tendencies. Our PHP program is a full day program, so it's 8 to 3.30. Kiddos get four, in it, four hours of intensive therapy, therapeutic treatment. And then our program is unique in a way that we also um, have three and a half hours of education. So some of the other intensive programs will have that education component, but a lot of them tend to do like state minimum what it's required for academics. When we focus, we have a high focus on education because we know that when kids are coming to our program, they're leaving school, right? And so we don't want them to get further behind in school. And then they have all this anxiety about having to go back to school and getting caught up on their homework when they're already struggling. So we wanna to try to have a balance with that. Along with our PHP program, we also have our IOP program, which again is a step down from um, the PHP program, and that is 3.30 to 6.30 in the afternoon, so kids can come to our program after school. And that's really, again, looking at three hours of intensive therapeutic time, so it's different than the traditional outpatient, you get about an hour of therapeutic time. This has been a presentation of the AMP Honors Program from CV Academics.